Beautiful chickens, in this video, you will learn the most important essential quadratic identities that you will need to know for the SAT math section. I want to warn you guys that you not only need to know them and recognize them, but also know them from left to right and also from right to left. From right to left is for those of you who are, are uh, committed to 800, 700 on the SAT math section. Those are for the more, more difficult math questions. So let's do this. Uh, the first identity I want to talk to you guys about is the first one here. I like to call it SOS. SOS stands for square of a sum. Inside of the parentheses right here, we have a sum, A plus B, and then we have a square. So therefore, it's square of a sum. And here, I want you to remember genetics, maybe bio class. Remember when um, a child grabs one chromosome from the mother and one chromosome from the dad. So here, kind of exactly what we're having here. So A squared is the mom, B squared is the dad, and then they're going to have two babies, AB. So A one chromosome and B one chromosome, and then they're going to have two of them. The next quadratic identity, I call it SOD because now it is square of a difference because A minus B. Then again, A squared, B squared, you have your mom and you have your dad, but because um, the quality of dad was negative, the babies are also going to be negative. So maybe in this math world, the characteristics of the father determine the characteristics of the children. So here, if the daddy was positive, then the kids are going to be positive. If the daddy was negative, then the kids are going to be negative. So the same exact situation, but don't worry about this sign. The daddy at the end will always be positive, but the kids are going to be affected by um, the state of the daddy. So SOS, SOD, super important, like I said, not only from here to here, but also backwards. Let me show you what I mean by that. So when uh, you see something like, I will just zoom in here. If you see something like X minus three, all of it is squared. Many of you will recognize that this is SOD, square of a difference. And then you have x squared minus 6x plus 9. Also, this is going from right to left. But are you able to see this and quickly understand, ooh, what I'm looking at is nothing more, nothing less than just x minus 3. All of it is squared. That is going from right to left and from left to right. Now. We're going to go to the very last um, formula, and that formula is DOS. One moment. Let me move my face. DOS stands for difference of squares. We have the first square, and we have the second square, and here we have its difference. It's going to equal to A plus B times A minus B. You want to be able to know that 7 squared minus x squared, um, you don't have to have parentheses around that, is going to be 7 minus x, 7 plus x. But also, when you see this, you want to be able to go backwards and say, oh, this used to be 49 minus x squared. This is what I mean when I say going from right to left, but also from left to right. Hope this video helped you guys to remember these quadratic identities. Um, these are just my codes that I use with my clients. Uh, when we see a problem that has to do with identities, I always ask them, is this SOS, is this SOD or DOS? You don't have to use this as long as you commit, commit them to memory and as long as you know how to go from left to right and from right to left. And in the next video, we're going to do a hard problem and another hard problem. We're going to do two hard problems that are um, involving these identities. I'll see you in the next video.